welcome back to Genshin Impact. In this episode, we are going to be doing Noelle's uh, first act of her story quest. Um, now, if you guys don't mind, I'm going to be bringing up Noelle's guide so when that the I. When out, bathe in sunlight. Without talking, I'm gonna shut up. But when the moon's out, bathe in moonlight. Okay. So. Silly churl, Billy churl, silly Billy hilly churl. Ooh. Holy crap, there's a lot of. Okay, a lot of choices I have to make. I have a feeling I'm not gonna like this first one. Is that the honorary knight? Someone's calling you. Let's go check it out. I finally get to meet you, honorary knight. I'm Noelle, a maid of the Knights of Favonius. Ah, oh, apologies. I've yet to officially join the knights. As a maid, and in order to be worthy of this armor, I'm currently undergoing the Knights of Favonius chivalric training. Yes. I haven't passed the selection trials yet, but I've been asking senior knights for advice on how to become a true knight of Favonius. I asked Amber how to make a baron bunny. Oh, and Kaya's been keeping me busy with various small tasks. <laughs> I even asked the Spark Knight to pass on her experiences, although <laughs> Master Jean grounded us shortly after. Actually, I have always wanted to receive guidance from the Honorary Knight. I, I was worried that it might be too presumptuous to ask. I've seen you on the streets of Mondstadt occasionally, but I've always been too busy to disturb you. I just finished today's cleaning for the Knights and was about to start my training when I saw you. I... Oh, if it's not too much trouble, could I ask you for some guidance on my chivalric training? So... As a senior knight, this is your suggestion? But as a maid, I'm only authorized to deal with smaller tasks. The Knights of Favonius is the strongest shield that Mondstadt has. How can I defend the people if I'm only ever dealing with minor matters? That's why I've always wanted to become a real Knight of Favonius. To have the power to help more people. <laughs> that's, a funny, that's a funny response. Really? Even the honorary knight? I thought the Honorary Knight would only ever be busy with powerful enemies, like Storm Terror. Well, that is true. Come to think of it, whenever I see you in Mondstadt, you do always seem to be in a hurry. And the fact is, you're hurrying to help others. Oh, okay. Back to Mondstadt it is. Time for today's training to officially begin. Your point of view on these matters has truly been eye-opening for me. I have a lot to learn. Just like you said, from now on, I'm going to treat helping people with smaller tasks as a part of my training. Just thinking about it makes me feel more motivated than ever. Wow, Noelle's motivated all right. She's got that give me a commission before I take them all vibe. Paimon saying vibe. Let's go. Why is she walking so much faster than me? Slow down. I can't go. There we go. Oh, uh, someone. Anyone. Who's that? I, I need to help. Noelle! Oh, she's so fast. Let's catch up with her. There, there. Take your time. Try and take a deep breath first. And finally, I, I was saved. Well, my name's Noelle. Don't worry, sir. Everything's all right. I'll be protecting you from now on. So, where are you from? I don't think we've met in Mondstadt before. Thanks. I... I'm not from Mondstadt. My name is Aloise. I'm a traveling merchant. I was on my way to Mondstadt to acquire some of the reputed local wines, 
so I could take them back to Lyra. Little did I know... Uh, little did I know I'd run into savage monsters on the way. I mean, savage. They were twice my height. I was so scared I ran all the way here until I just couldn't run anymore. Thank goodness I found you in this, uh, maid. It's okay, Mr. Aloise. We're not far from Mondstadt. Although I'm just an ordinary maid, the small task of escorting a visitor to the city is certainly within my power. Uh, uh escort me to Mondstadt? Perfect! Let's go! But, wait a moment. As a traveling merchant, you must have luggage and some goods. Don't worry. No matter the quantity, I'll carry them for you. Uh, luggage? Goods? Uh, yes. I remember now. The, the savage monsters I encountered? That's when I lost them. No, no, no need. These monsters are ferocious. Um, three times my height. They got bigger. Oh, rest easy. This is Mondstadt's honorary knight. No monsters too ferocious for him. Uh, honorary knight? Then you're a member of the Knights of Favonius? I, uh... I... I, I can't remember exactly. I, I was too busy running. But probably near that crossing in front of us. But, but I can't be sure. Oh, never mind. Wait! Wait a minute! My chest! <laughs> a sudden pain in my chest! <laughs> the music! Let's that running! Let's look for those things a little bit later. Oh! Chest pain? Here, I've got you. Hold my arms and lie down slowly. Now do your best to relax. I will examine you. Uh, perhaps I... Uh, maybe you... I'm sorry. I must stay here to watch over our visitor. It looks like you'll need to handle the monsters. Oh, and please be careful. This guy is sussy. He's a sussy baka. Strange. No trace of any large monsters here. Ooh, here they come! Huh? It's just a few ordinary slimes. Hyman didn't see any goods on the road. Is this the right place? Let's head back to Noel. Bro, what? What's up, bro? Back so soon. Ah, oh, a true senior knight. Did you see Mr. Aloise's luggage on the way? Uh, perhaps the monsters ate it? Didn't I tell you? It's dangerous. Oh, you're not hurt, are you? Um, what I meant was, when they jumped, they were thrice, um, twice as tall as me. Why are you looking at me like that? Even if they were only slimes, I couldn't have fought them off. Oh, what can we do? If even the honorary knight can't find them? <laughs> I'm just a traveling merchant. You never know what's gonna happen out here. Oh well, looks like Mondstadt was never meant to be. Perhaps next time. Oh, I'm very sorry. In these circumstances, I must ask you to register the quantity and nature of your lost property with the Knights of Favonius. I know that the Knights will do their best to help you recover your goods. Ah, uh, no, no, no. I couldn't possibly trouble the Knights of Favonius. This matter, it really is beneath them. On the contrary, it's the duty of the Knights to look after any visitors traveling to and from Mondstadt. As a maid, I must do my best in receiving and escorting such visitors. But then, perhaps there's something keeping you from going to the Knights? <laughs> no, absolutely nothing. Hmm? Everything okay? Well, actually, I noticed that too. But since we don't have any evidence of wrongdoing, he deserves the benefit of the doubt. This gentleman was seeking help at the gates of Mondstadt, which makes him a guest of the city. Therefore, I must carry out my maidly duties. Ah, <sighs> thank you for understanding. Hey. What are you discussing? So, what's next? Oh, sorry to keep you waiting. We've talked it over, and we've decided to escort you back to Mondstadt. <laughs> this 
This is a long quest, holy crap. <laughs> Honorary Knight in Noel. Were you two out on a mission? Wait, who is this person behind you? Uh, my name is Aloise. I'm a humble merchant. Ah, Mondstadt welcomes you, strange yet respectable traveler. Please state your identity and purpose. The Knights of Favonius are here to ensure your safety. Uh, <clears throat> I came to Mondstadt to import wines back to Lyra. I see, but... Are you not carrying any luggage or goods? I also don't see your name among the wine merchants that Mondstadt regularly deals with. I, it's my first time visiting Mondstadt, but I expect to come back often. Hmm. In that case, please show me the relevant documents issued by Liu's Ministry of Civil Affairs. I need to verify your identity. Huh? What on earth is the min? Oh, right, right. I, um, put them in my luggage. Luggage? Oh, our apologies. This gentleman was just attacked by a monster, and lost both his luggage and his goods. Could you allow him to calm down a bit before we register him with the Knights? Hmm. According to Article 10 of the Knights of Favonius Handbook, caution should be exercised with regard to unfamiliar visitors. But Article 2 of the Knights of Favonius Handbook also says that one must not offend our visitors, right? Hmm. <sighs> well, in this situation, it seems the Knights of Favonius Handbook has a bit of an overlap. Hmm. If Noel is willing to vouch for him, then I can rest easy. Oh, I'm just doing my job. Most reliable. I've got a ways to go, but I will try to live up to that. Well then, I'm counting on you two to take care of this gentleman while he's in Mondstadt. So, you're a wine merchant? Well, you must have excellent wine knowledge. Would you like to rest a while at Angel Share? A better price? It's our signature tavern. Such a warm welcome. How could I refuse? Ah, uh, Angel Share. So this barrel must be full with Mondstadt celebrated wine, right? If only it could be imitated. Oh, uh, imported. That's the word. Sorry to keep you waiting. Drink up. This is a dandelion wine-based cocktail. I asked the bartender to add calla lily because it has a calming effect. I know you've been on the road for a long time, and cold drinks would be bad for your stomach. So I requested less ice. I hope it's to your liking. Calming? Is this what they give to all visitors in Mondstadt? <laughs> <laughs> uh, because you know I'm interested in Mondstadt wines? <laughs> yes. Just interested, mind you. On another note, that drink's made me realize just how empty my stomach is. Oh, so you're hungry too. Oh, how terrible of me. If I'd realized, I would have saved some pancakes for you. Oh, good idea. That sounds like a good place. Smells incredible. So it's true. If you really want to sell Mondstadt wines, you can't do without Mondstadt dishes. Maybe recipes will be easier to obtain than the brewing process. Oh, uh, what I mean is the dandelion wine brewing process is unique, difficult to imitate. That's why we merchants can buy with confidence. <laughs> Where was I? Uh, let's see. What's on the menu? Hmm. So many dishes. Hard to decide. Can I help? Uh, sure. What do you suggest? Hmm. Well, do you prefer red meat or white? I like them both. The steaks here are cuts of freshly shipped Springvale boar. I'd recommend having it served medium to really bring out the natural sweetness of the meat. Mmm. Oh, sweet madame is another specialty. Crispy skin and tender meat goes perfectly with wine. However, those dishes alone aren't very healthy from a nutritional standpoint. I recommend a mushroom pizza and a satisfying salad, too, on the side. 
If that sounds okay, I'll place the order for you. This meal is on me. To make up for my inattentiveness. That's too generous of you. Please, enjoy. After all, it's your first meal here as a new visitor. And your last. I wouldn't want to give you the cold shoulder. Huh? <laughs> my, my last? Uh, you give this meal to all new visitors, right? Wait, is it really my last meal? Ah, <laughs> so that's what it means. Well, then I better make the most of it. How about with wind comes glory? For our final stop, I want to leave Mr. Aloise with something to commemorate his time here. So, that's the final stop, yes? Wait, what are we commemorating? Oh, here's your order, Noel. Thanks, Marjorie. Mr. Eloise, please accept this souvenir. Uh, thanks. I will treasure this wood carving for a... Huh? Wait, what's on that... Is that the insignia of the Knights of Favonius? I, Maid Noel, on behalf of Mondstadt and the Knights of Favonius, officially welcome you. Wait, Knights of Favonius? How can you be both a maid and a part of the Knights of Favonius? So, so this gift is also a... So, it's a, a warning? Oh, I'm afraid this is all I had time for. However, I hope it leaves you with a lasting impression of your trip to Mondstadt. Now then, if you wouldn't mind accompanying me to the Knights of Favonius, the registration process only requires. Ah, uh, no need. I, I suddenly I remember where I lost my luggage. Oh, well then we should at least go and file a report with the Knights. Nope, not necessary. Uh, now that the danger's passed, I'll just head over and retrieve it. Huh? But what about the savage monsters? For your protection, I feel strongly that one of our knights should escort you there. Or. Perhaps it's a little too soon, but I'll escort you. Let's go. <sighs> oh, you want to escort him yourself? Oh, that would certainly put my mind at rest. In that case, I'll report the situation to Swan. Let's meet back at the gates of the city a little later. Please take care of Mr. Aloise. So, this is the end? Meaning this is a good spot? Archon's above! Oh, Honorable Knight, please have mercy! Forgive me! I'll confess. I'll confess to everything. I was planning to investigate Mondstadt's dandelion wine, to see if I could find a way to imitate it. I didn't expect you to see right through it from the start. Please! I... I never actually did anything. It's attempted fraud at worst, right? Tell me it isn't punishable by death, or or is it because you have no intention to try me at all? Which explains why you didn't expose me in the city. You simply chose a location to kill me. Spare me, noble knight. What? Go? I can go? Of course, with you and the maid around, who would dare? Y yes, sir. I, I understand. Goodbye, most honorable honorary knight. So, he really did have ulterior motives. Should we tell Noel? Let's head back and see how she's doing first. Ah, you're back. Eh? Well, how come Mr. Eloise isn't with you? Left? Already? Left Mondstadt? Oh, and I didn't even get around to arranging his accommodations. Or introducing the wine merchants to him. Oh, I must have been negligent in some way. 
Did I leave him with a bad impression of Mondstadt? Why else would he have left without a farewell? Oh, I, I couldn't even handle the smallest of tasks. A plot? So he was scheming the whole time? As expected. I'm still too naive. And that's why we have the honorary knight to rely on in times of trouble. <sighs> How can I ever become a real knight of Favonius like this? True. True. That was a long one. She has two acts, bro. That's crazy. Alright, so... We gotta do it again. So... Same thing. Gotcha. Come on, enough procrastinating. Let's go. Honorary Knight? I'm Noelle, a maid of the Knights of Favonius. Ah, oh, apologies. I've yet to officially join the Knights. Oh, um... Okay. As a maid... I actually and, didn't mean to yes, have to do all this. Asked, I even asked the... Actually... I was worried. I've seen you. I just finished. I... So, but as the Knights of Favonius, that's why I've always wanted to become a real Knight of Favonius. Really? If I thought the Honorary Knight... Well, come to think of it, and the fact is, you're hurrying to help others. Oh. Um, so I actually don't need to do all this. Your point of view on these matters has truly been I- Uh, yeah. Here it is. There we go. Wait, uh, my name is Al- Ah, my- Please state your idea. Uh, <clears throat> I see. I also don't- I, It's my- f Hmm. Huh? Oh, luggage? Oh, uh, could you allow- <laughs> The way he says that is so funny. <clears throat> luggage? It seems the Knights of Favonius handbook okay, has a- Well, if you are keeping watch, there shouldn't be a problem. After all, this is our honorary knight. The one who defended Mondstadt from the claws of the frenzied Storm Terror. Uh, storm? Terror? <laughs> Indeed. Good one. Well then, I'm counting on you two to take care of this gentleman while he's in Mondstadt. So, you're a wine merchant? Well, you must have excellent wine knowledge. Didn't mean to do that. Would you like to rest a while at Angel's Share? It's our signature tavern. Such a warm welcome. Ah, uh, Angel's share. Oh, uh, Sorry to keep you- This is a damn- I know you've been on the- So I requested- Call me. Is this what they give- Noelle's way of showing hospitality. <laughs> oh, okay then. On another note, that drink's made me realize just how empty my- Oh, so- Oh, how terrible of- Ooh, good idea. Okay. Dude, I'm hungry. I'm not gonna lie. I got this- Domino's Pizza is sitting right next to me, bro. I'm about to just munch mm. on this bitch. Smells incredible. Maybe recipes will be easier to obtain than the brewing. Oh, um, what I mean is the dandelion wine brewing process is unique, difficult to imitate. That's why we. <laughs> Where was I? Can I help? Uh, sure. Hmm. 
I like them both. The steaks here, mmm. However, the I recommend, if that sounds okay... That's too... Please enjoy... Huh? You give this... <laughs> oh, okay, then. How about with wit for our final... So, wait. Getting quite busy. Oh, here's your... Thanks, Marjorie. Mr. Ella... Uh, wait. I maid... Wait, Knights of Favonius? How can you be both a maid and a part of the Knights of Favonius? So, so this gift is also a... So, just a regular souvenir? Uh, I'm afraid this is all I had time for. However, I hope it leaves you... I, I really don't understand why you went to all this trouble. I don't have any goods or relevant documents. Plus, I don't exactly look like your everyday honest merchant. Even if there were nothing to suggest otherwise, surely it would have been better to take me straight to the Knights for investigation. And yet you still went to all this effort to prepare all this for me. Didn't you wonder whether the savage monsters, the missing cargo, what if it were all lies? Why would I think that? I'm just doing what a maid of Favonius should do. Knights of Favonius Handbook Article 2. Do not exhibit suspicion or hostility towards visitors. No matter how suspicious they may seem, you are a visitor from far away. You should be welcomed by me and by Mondstadt, even if there really is only a slight possibility that everything you say is true. <laughs> Being attacked by savage monsters, losing goods and documents, isn't it times like these that people need help the most? And if I had failed to offer our hospitality on such an occasion, despite there being no evidence to back up your claims, well, that's not the way a maid of Favonius should behave. I see. Well, thank you. It's time for me to leave Mondstadt. Huh? Why the hurry? We haven't recovered your lost property yet. No need. I just remembered where I left them. Somewhere far, far away. I'll be sure to keep a better eye on them next time. Perhaps when I'm a visitor worthy of your hospitality, I can return to Mondstadt. Um, I'm not sure I fully understand what you mean. <laughs> but if you think you can retrieve your lost property, that's great. What a short trip. But thank you for your care and hospitality. I've learned a lot. <sighs> Goodbye, Mondstadt. Goodbye, Maid of the Knights of Favonius. Ah, okay then. Goodbye. Mondstadt and I, Maid Noel of the Knights of Favonius, will always welcome you when you return. All right, second inning done, and we're already 30 minutes in, so I can probably do one more. I'll do one more, and then we'll do, um, the last three endings of this first act, and after that I'm gonna take a break, because I'm getting kind of bored, even though the story is interesting, but I'm getting a little bored. All right, third, third ending. Okay. So I actually have to go to the beginning for this one. the Knights of Favonius. Oh, apologies. I've yet to as a maid, and yes, I asked Aunt. I even asked the... Actually, I, I was worried. I've seen you. I just finished... I... Okay, this is where we start. Um, okay. I, I'd like to get your opinion on something as a senior knight. I've been keeping up with my maidly duties and knightly exercises, but training progress has been a little slow. You know, just basic strength and endurance training. A hundred push-ups, a hundred sit-ups, a hundred squats. Ooh, I like the sound of that. And running two laps around Mondstadt as a morning routine. 
Damn, she's really getting the work in. I'm actually incredibly busy every day. It's just that I always feel like something's missing. Str <laughs> strength? But I think I'm pretty strong. Well, after he got drunk, I carried Mr. Bruce back to the Knights of Favonius headquarters myself. I also carried the library's new bookshelves over from Springvale. Even Mr. Huffman is feeling strong. Ah, of course. Oh, however, even though it's only training, I can't raise my sword against the honorary knight. Oh, I've got it. Let's go to the training ground at the Knights of Favonius headquarters. There should be some training dummies there. I know where that is. Talked to Noelle when I became Noelle. Hi, Noelle. Are you here for the training too? Oh, our honorary knight has come too. Hi, Ellen. I was just asking the honorary knight for training advice. They want to see my basic skills first. Do you still have spare training dummies here? Oh, Noelle's basic skills, huh? Then the normal dummies won't do. Doesn't matter how we set them up, there'll be nothing left by the time Noelle's done with them. It is Noelle, after all. Let me think. How should I arrange them? Ah, I've got it. One moment. Oh. This will work much better for Noelle. Hmm. Could be a problem. There sure are a lot. Huh. It'll certainly require one heck of a cleanup. Why is Noelle... Is she planning to destroy them all in one go? <sighs> what a pity. So close. Wanna try again? <gasps> she really got all of them! Whew. Finally, clean up over. Phew. Oh, you're too kind. A praise from the honorary knight is high praise indeed. But sadly, I'm afraid that my strength is the only thing I truly am confident in. Every time I train and compete with the knights, I can't figure out how to use it. Even though I swing my blade with greater force than my opponent, I always seem to lose in the final moments. No matter how hard I train, I can never pass the selection trials. Oh, why? I just can't figure it out. Real-world fighting experience? I guess that's true. After all, if I were to leave the city, I wouldn't be there when people needed me. But you're right. I haven't had much real-world fighting experience. Where can I get some? Areas around Mondstadt. Slimes. Leave them to me. Here we are. Let's start with Geo Slimes. Leave it all to me. She's it's too quick for her to hit him. I'll catch up. <laughs> huh. 
The next target is... an Eye of the Storm? Lisa were here. No, I can't think like that. As a knight, I must rely on my own strength. Huh? But... That makes sense. If only I'd fought together with you just now. The camaraderie and solidarity of its members form the backbone of the Knights of Favonius. So that's what Article 8 of the Knights of Favonius Handbook really means. I never... Looked at it that way before. Me? You think I can choose a suitable target? Really? Let me think. Huh. I should avoid enemies that I find difficult and consider the power of teamwork. <laughs> hmm. Ah, I've got it. I heard from Master Jean that there was a hilly trail camp nearby that often attacks traveling merchants. Even though driving away hilly trails is usually something for the knights. Maybe this time, I can do it. Great. You and me. Take the Animo Archon. Finally, I'm saved. <coughs> uh, and thanks to Noel and the Honorary Knight, too. If it hadn't been for you two, I can't imagine what would have happened. You guys are here to save me, right? We were training nearby and happened to hear you calling my name. Luckily, we got here just in time. <laughs> I think I wanted to say help or Barbados protect me or something to that effect. I didn't even realize that I'd called out Noel's name instead. I guess in Mondstadt, we're just so used to calling Noelle's name when we're in trouble. Oh, it's fine. It's an honor to be able to help everyone. Not to mention, I might not have registered Henning's cry if that weren't the case. Still, good thing the hilly churls we encountered weren't too fierce. <sighs> Thankfully, I was able to handle them. Huh? Not too fierce? I was so scared I couldn't even move my legs. Oh, really? I just did what I usually do. Ah, oh, I guess so. I did have my mind set on not letting Henning get hurt. So if my intention is different, it can have a big effect on the outcome. You know, I think you're right. Whenever Noelle is helping us out, she's usually more powerful than in training. <laughs> uh, absolutely. No more of that. In any case, I'm extremely grateful to you both. N no problem. Merely fulfilling my duties as a maid of Favonius. <clears throat> Maid Noel of the Knights of Favonius at your service. <laughs> That's a good ending. 
got more reward, reward, reward rewards. <laughs> Alright. Well, that's the first half of Noelle's story quest done. Um, I think we'll get the second half in the next episode. So, thank you all for watching, and I'll see you on the next one. Peace.